Ladies and gentlemen, heroes of all ages, welcome back to the Heart of the Storm. This is episode number 37 of Hotscast, recorded 1030 on the right coast, 27th January, 2015. Hotscast is the podcast for the people, the players, the heroes, covering all the awesome that is the Blizzard Entertainment Brawler, Heroes of the Storm. I'm your host, Vincent Minucci, a.k.a. Rillandoon. With me, as always, are my intrepid co-hosts. First up, we have Kaylee, a.k.a. Nerdy Char, a.k.a. I'm too busy raiding to remember what time we're supposed to be podcasting. Hold on a second. Let's, <laughs> let's clarify this, because I told them when they recruited me that I podcast at 10, and we normally stop at like 9.30, but we were doing really good tonight, so they didn't want to stop. That's okay. In fact, I'm the one who stopped the raid. I felt kind of bad. But you wiped the raid. No, stopped Stop the it. raid. Like, no, I was wiped. like, I must go. You're like, it's all right, podcast. guys. Wipe it up. We couldn't wipe continue it up. without you. I got a podcast. Wipe it up. Well, I mean, we're only like a 10-man group, so it's oh. kind of like... They need to get, what are you, you, you playing while well again? So. I forget. What's your character? Um, well, my main right now is a priest, but okay. I also have... The one that I was raiding on is my warlock. Okay. Disc? Holy? Spreest? My, it's a Shadow Priest Spreast. with a disc off spec. Spreest disc. Nice. Mm-hmm. I'm, I so miss my Shadow Priest slash Holy Priest. Well, if you really hurry not. up and level your rogue, you could... He is 97 <laughs> as of oh. this morning. Can we, talk about, really? yes. can we talk about how stupid disc is, though? Because you can seriously, like, throw a couple heals and then just spam damage on the boss and out-heal everyone. Why is that a bad thing? I'm just saying it's it's that stupid. That sounds like a fun mechanic. Like I literally just sit there and spam damage on the boss, and I'm top on the meters every That's single time. That's awesome. Because it's just like AOE heals everywhere, and That's shields awesome. going up, and it's just like I don't know. But anyway, there's nothing wrong with that. That's awesome. I yeah, I just I don't know. I have good gear, but I don't know. Anyway, so my make your gear me make your <laughs> make your scooch higher than yours. <laughs> yeah, you're not it even level hundred, so I wouldn't. I'm not even uh... level hundred. My my gear score isn't. Not important, so. Yeah. Less well, success. my my amazing video game quote for this week that nobody will respond to on Twitter, cough, <laughs> cough, <laughs> is... <laughs> <Send her tweet. laughs> no matter what happens, even if you become the world's enemy, I'll be your knight. Name that quote. Wow. You can do it, guys. That's a tougher one. I just, it is well, tough. I'm it's good. a little That's obscure. A I'm even looking at what You'll get, like, answers from that I don't one. even know what it is. Yes, I know who it is yes. and the game, but hmm. yeah. Well, it, well it's, you know so it is. <laughs> I'll give I'll give you a a a hint, listeners. It is a uh, video game that's part of a series, and it's one of the lesser popular like Less popular. parts of that series. Yeah, it, it's, it's made by a developer that's not quite a circle. <laughs> that's a little bit too much of a. <laughs> <laughs> Too much of a hit. Too much of a hit. What have you been playing this week? Well, I know nobody wants to hear it, but League of Legends ranked season just started, so it did. Uh, no, it did. That's okay. And they oh, started yes. streaming uh, the things, yes. the matches again. I've been watching. Yes. The yeah. new map is looks nice. Holy cow! I hadn't actually yeah. seen the new look of the map. It's I haven't very seen it cell shaded. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I it, love it, cell shaded. I love anything cell shaded. It looks nice. I'm. I, I liked the old one better. I'm gonna be honest. It's a little more but... brush strokey than the old one. The old one seemed a little yeah. more like really well, um, like like sharp. Like this is sharp. Yeah. This one. The the old one was sharp. Like really. Like yeah. it's very sharp. This one's very brush strokey kind of. Brush yeah. strokey. Plus, it's like... weird. I'm confused by these random other mob things that are wandering around, and they change the look of the the big mobs. And um, I've got to watch LCS. I, I need There's to watch some weird stuff going on. Is it brush so like kind of like taking off of like Guild Wars Two style brush Yeah, yeah, actually. really, yes. yeah, similar, really? It's very watercolor, very similar. Yeah. Ooh, interesting. Mm-hmm. I yeah. love cool. the art style of Guild Wars Two. Yeah. yeah. Oh, this it's is interesting. All yeah, right. I thought it looked nice. I thought it looked very nice. Very different. So, very different. All right. It's different. I mean, they they've people who've been playing for a long time. I'm sure probably find it weird plus they changed other things it wasn't just the look yeah there's a lot of other stuff and changes to the maps and how they work and things so yeah. interesting 
Very right. nice. Yeah, so so other than League, it. what have you been playing? Well, I did play a little bit of Heroes this week, and uh, played a few matches of Hearthstone, and then of course WoW, because stupid garrison missions, damn it. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm logging in 10 minutes today. crazy over there. He is yeah. raiding, and I asked him to be quiet, but Put, put a towel on Well, I like during the quiet time, he was this. Yeah, during the quads, all right. Like, tap, 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 tap. I like. I can only do so much. I've asked him to be quiet, and oh man, it did nothing. I'll put myself back on mute now. Oh my gosh, Crayhan, you uh, he just insulted soccer. I'm sorry, sir, but we are no longer friends. I'm sorry. He didn't care if you ins sorry. insulted League of Legends. He cared you, that you insulted you soccer. You can insult my mother, <laughs> but you do not insult soccer. You do not insult the world's greatest game. Oh, terrible. I, well, no, soccer is not the world's greatest game. Don't even start. Don't even start. The world's greatest Don't game no, plays no, its final no. match on Sunday. I, I don't even know. It. I, I, no, 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 I'm sorry, no. Go Seahawks, by the way. No. Everyone who's listening, go Seahawks. No, sorry. You can go. I want to go Seahawks just because I dislike <laughs> I dislike the Patriots so much. So I, know, I root for I root for the Seahawks. Dolphins and anybody who plays the Patriots. That's pretty much yeah. what. I... <laughs> at, at this point, I agree with, with, you all, with all the crap the Patriots have done, with the whole videotaping the coaches, you know, calling the plays with the deflated balls thing, like. What the hell? I still think is that's pretty funny. Over there, like seriously, Adam, <laughs> what is the going on? deflated he balls has been a source of great comedic value across the entire is, United oh States the, and the, probably the rest of the world. The Every radio clips, station has oh used the gosh, fact that their balls oh. are correctly inflated as something that they say. And I've and, handled, <laughs> I've handled so many balls this week. I've touched so many yeah, balls. Yeah, yeah, oh yeah, my yeah. Gosh. It's it's I amazing love, the it's comedy that has has ensued people, from the deflation of balls. <laughs> for people who appreciate good like balls and fart and poop jokes, like this has just been great. <laughs> Oh, yeah, this has been the best. Five ball jokes with fart and poop jokes. Oh, balls jokes and poop jokes go right hand in hand. Come on. Sure. Not for a woman. Hand. Hand it's still hand. equally as funny. <laughs> no, in all honesty, though, your question, they just need to seriously ban Bill Belichick from the game. I like, don't Get him that. out of the freaking NFL. He's okay. such a I think they should ban him from soccer. Crap. I really think that that would be a good for idea. soccer. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, Bill Belichick should be banned from soccer. He would be so yeah. mad. I mean, get him out. <laughs> yes. And yes, he Zach, might deflate some of the soccer bad. balls. That would be horrible. Yes. My, <laughs> just join the chat who, who correctly stated soccer is life. And yes, soccer is okay. life. See, so if they banned Bill Belichick from soccer, yes. he would be banned from life. So there yes. you go. And so, yes, apple, and not only do the Patriots juice. suck, but the New England Revolution suck as well. So screw you, New England Revolution. Philadelphia Union. Okay. We have Are you talking about soccer? More... What's that? Yeah, New England Revolution is the so is their uh, their MLS soccer team. I actually I, as much soccer as I hate them, they are actually, actually a pretty good team. I have to give them that. They are pretty decent. They've got some Go good players. City. Why Woo. do soccer teams have the worst names ever? At least City. football teams have Woo. good names. Really? Go the Miami Orlando. Dolphins is a good name. City. Uh, yeah. Heck yeah. yeah Miami. Do not diss on the Dolphins. You have two Dolphins fans in here. You are the outcast, sir. Don't you be <laughs> Go Orlando City. Cleveland. I'll start I'll start voting for the city. Watch out. Well, that's a dumb that's a dumb name. I don't I mean, disagree. Let's with that just one. say you could put the word stain at the end of that. All right. Yeah, like if well. if, you if your the team baseball has the red end in stain, like come on. Let's be honest yeah, well. here. <laughs> Uh oh, Crayhan's getting tired already. I don't know, revolution <laughs> Anyway. Yeah. Oh, yeah, so Sorry, this is this is a podcast about Heroes of the Storm. So you played WoW. Well. Yes. Yeah. So you played WoW. Well and you hate the Patriots. <laughs> Got yes. It. As any good American should. Except Adam, who lives like right down the street from them. So I, I don't guess think he's he likes the Patriots either. No? There's other teams up there he could like instead. Does. Is there? He likes well, the I guess... Giants, I think. Isn't there isn't there another football team in New York that's a kind of like there's, in Western New York? There's actually a couple. Yeah, there's like three New York teams actually. It's like <laughs> yeah, yeah, they get the Giants and the Jets. 
Well, no, there's a yeah, third there, one. Well, there, there's another one that Everyone plays in like eight feet of snow, that. pretty much every day, I think, yeah, or something like that. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody just kind of conveniently forgets they I don't exist. Know. Yes. Something. Yes. They, they, their their name is kind of another word for uh, dollar. Yes, dollar, dollar, <laughs> buffaloes, yo. Oh, Seedsville's like. Oh yeah. Anyway, what are we doing that. here? We got a show. <laughs> we do a show. About. All right. Next up, we've got Mike, aka Finless, aka Who's that guy. We. We doing this, yo? We <laughs> doing this, yo. <laughs> yes. By the way, that's the message I got on Skype. We doing this, yo? <laughs> I accident. I typed we doing this, and then I forgot I had not did not hit enter. And then I went back and just was going to say yo, like, hey. And I typed yo and hit enter, and it said we doing like this, yo. Story. <laughs> and then I sent it to Nerdy this. because, you know, why not? <laughs> While she was rating. <laughs> I said, should I, should I say we doing this, yo? And he said, yep. <laughs> <laughs> so it is. Hello. Like, what have you been <laughs> I have, well, first I have my my hero oh, quote of the yes, week. My yes. hero quote of the week, which is getting harder and harder. No, actually, it's not getting hard to find. Uh, this is one from George Bernard Shaw. Pretty swanky, huh? You cannot swanky. be a hero without being a coward. And what this means is, hug the turret. <laughs> that does mean hug the turret. What's that mean? Not be it means hug the turret. That does I mean hug know. the turret. Yeah, he's hug the turret. That was for real. Bernard that was Shaw real. was drinking quite drinking. a bit of scotch when he said that. I don't know if he was drinking or something. I don't know. <laughs> Any gentleman in his era was drinking quite a bit of scotch. This is true. Something. This is absolutely true. Yes, their socks were so. Yeah, I was right. I knew what Adam, Adam was a fan of. I'm good. I pay attention. <laughs> what have you been playing, Mike? I have been playing, of course, World of Warcraft. And Naturally. the Garrison game, and World of Garrison uh, Craft. quite a bit. World of Garrison Craft. I have my six one hundred, so it takes a while to or five one hundred. Dude, you are one ninety something. Another two ninety something. Yeah, just a lot. Of oh Where does your so. face unscrew so we can see the robot parts underneath? Yes, like the um. The, uh, you know what? Uh, Warlords is so much fun to level in that it's just fun to. It play. is fun, so dude. The questing is so it. good. It's it so yeah. good. It's just sm- like I've said before. It's smooth. Um, yes. It's uh, smooth as a fresh jar of Skippy, as Urban Funk would say. Uptown Funk would say. Sorry, not Urban Funk. Uptown Funk. Urban my Uptown favorite. Funk. What, no, it's not Urban. It's just Uptown. I misspoke. No, it's, it's for the for the possible show <laughs> titles. It is for now the title, Urban, sure, Uptown, Urban Funk. Uptown Funk. It's just Uptown Funk. But is there going to be one about yeah, the They say balls? smooth, smooth as a fresh jar now. of Skippy is one of my favorite deflated balls. Um, deflated yes, which is I very played a bunch of heroes. Yeah. Very topical. I played a bunch of heroes. Topical, yes. Topical deflated balls. Topical. Oh, <laughs> that one's getting a star next that to it. That one's a star right there. Um, I played a bunch of heroes. Um, I, I had, for, unfortunately, Adam, sorry, I had forgotten that they were recording on Friday and I wanted to listen to the show. And then all of a sudden he's like, hey, you going to play? And I was like, oh, yeah, you guys recorded. So I played a m- bunch of games till like two in the morning with them. Um, it was a lot of fun. Uh, we did really well, I think. We had a lot of fun games. Um, and yeah. uh, a yeah. bunch of other random things I've been playing which aren't worth mentioning, really. Okay. How about I've you, playing, What have you been playing? I've been playing a bunch of WoW. Actually, I played a lot of WoW. I did get my rogue up to 97. Been, been in WoW a lot. I actually... You are I like a been... tourist. You take forever to do anything. I do. You I are know. the people I, I yell at on the expressway know. that's not moving at all because you're busy I... looking around. I feel like I'm leveling as quick as like I don't feel like I'm taking long to level. I I don't know. I don't I don't know why. I don't feel like I'm moving slow. Like I'm going from quest to quest, and and I'll queue up for a dungeon, which as DPS takes 45 takes to 97 minutes to get into uh, Dungeon Finder, which is okay. Of course. But um, I, I'm absolutely loving it. I actually I don't do a whole lot with my garrison at the moment i mean i'll i'll mm-hmm. send out my dudes on missions and and uh i got my herb garden going in my mind and whatnot but i don't feel like i'm playing garrison craft as much as some other people are i believe well, but i have been loving the dungeons Aukendu yeah, is gorgeous oh my gosh it is gorgeous holy crap wow art team you guys are amazing Aukendu is beautiful uh, i actually the first time I zoned in, uh, I said to the group, you know, hey, this is my first run in the new Auchindoon, so go easy on me. They're like, oh, yeah, no worries. I take a couple steps in. I'm like, wow, 
this looks a lot different than it did in TBC, and they all just LOL <laughs> immediately. Like, yep. Um, it's not it's a big gorgeous. Hologram. Yeah, right. It's not a big hologram. <laughs> so, well, let's let's break this down. I think if there is uh, a bunch of guilds getting through the entire first um, raid instance, and you haven't hit max level yet. You're behind the curve. I know, dude, I'm definitely behind the curve. I, I don't <laughs> I don't play nearly as much as most people, but I have been playing a crap ton of heroes. So boom. Well that's okay. Now I haven't been playing a lot of heroes and I actually I actually played um I played a little bit this morning because uh, Battle.net was down. I played Guild Wars two. I, I decided to hop in. Yes. Um you know what? I I love Guild Wars two. I really do. I love the 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 combat in it. I just I wish there was more to keep me in it. Like it does not have that continuous wheel of awesome that WoW has, but um it's a beautiful game. It's a great game to jump in and out of. Um I mean it's it's perfect for that. And I do really enjoy it. I played my Guardian this morning for not long, maybe fifteen, twenty minutes. But uh it was fun. I had a really good time in it. Um after I waited for the patch because I haven't logged in in like six months. So there's a giant yeah. patch. Uh, a lot of patching. And apparently there is a, a uh, uh, expansion coming to yes. Guild Wars 2. They announced so, it. Yeah, that should be interesting. But uh, that's not Heroes. So let's get back no. into some Heroes talk and talk about some skins and mounts because there skins is some. And mounts. Yes. yes, there are. Yes, there are. Yeah. Uh, take very exciting. Very exciting. Cool. Lunar Festival is here. And I love Lunar Festival. how they are tying things in from WoW. I love that. Yeah. Keep yeah. doing that. Bring on that WoW tie-in. Love it. Go ahead. Yep. What do we so got? We got uh, Lunar Festival is here. Uh, obviously, sh- earlier than in WoW, but uh, it is here. And there are new Lunar Festival items available in the Hero Shop. So we've got new skins, new mounts, and new bundles, of course. The new skins are the Elder Chen skin, which looks really good, and that's awesome. $10 by itself. The Festival Lili skin, which looks really good, except Lili is still scary. Lili uh, not as scary face. as normal. She's not as creepy as normal in that skin. Well, there's a little, but, there's a little bit of creepy face yeah, there's coverage. There's like a thingy. There's like there's a, a thingy little creepy face coverage, yeah. 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 She does so, need more creepy um, face fixing. I think yeah, she looks yeah. significantly less creepy. There is creepy face coverage, but they need to fix creepy face. Yes, yes, I think so too. <laughs> so uh, the other thing is a new, yes, and it's a new name of the show. A new mount, the Lunar Tiger mount, which is really, really it good is looking. Beautiful. But only, of course, available with the purchase of the Lunar Festival yeah. Complete or Lunar Festival skin bundles. I don't but know. it will eventually become available for purchase as an individual item with future Which is good. Items. So I like Fine. that. So yes. at least that I'm glad is they're true. doing that. Just yes. like the um, carpet, the magic carpet, will be right. also uh, I am available for purchase at some point. Right. Some point. Someday. Someday. Right. Uh, at so, least we have the possibility. Correct. So the bundle, they say, join in our Lunar Festival celebration with two brand new bundle packs. Check out the limited time bundles. Make sure you pick them up before they're removed from the shop at some date to be determined in the future. <laughs> Lunar Festival Complete Bundle is now thirty two ninety six. I love when they use percentages to figure this out because they just get some random number. Yeah, right. Thirty two ninety six. Um and you it's get like the Walmart Lunar pricing. Tiger Mount. <laughs> Chen. Yeah, Walmart pricing. Uh Chen plus the Elder Chen skin and Lili and the Festival Lili skin. So that's thirty three dollars. I am rounding up. Um for that, then there's just the skin bundle, which is twenty two forty seven or twenty two fifty if you want to round that one. Uh, Lunar Tiger Mount, Elder Chen skin, and Festival Lili skin. So it's just the skins and the mount. Right now, so what we're saying is, the mount would cost cost you two dollars and forty seven cents if you just get the skin bundle, because if we look before, it was ten dollars each for the skins. Okay, nice um, you were saying. Gotcha. And okay. if you get the complete bundle, you are paying if you pay say it's 20 bucks for the skins, that's 12.96 for the mount, Chen and Lili. And then hmm. you're paying full price for the for the skins. Right. Not bad. So Not bad. Yeah, it's not too bad. So I, I do have to say though just the phrase skin bundle that is Yeah. Really, 
That's a little, a little bit. Little, yeah, yeah a little That's strange. like some Silent Hill stuff going on there. Oh, ooh, ee, ee. It sounds <laughs> like someone, someone might have uh, some deflated balls. That's all I'm saying. Someone may have some deflated balls. Some de- yeah, yeah. It's never and gonna go. That caused the, balls. That caused the skin bundle. I think is deflated what deflated balls <laughs> caused the skin bundle. Yes. <laughs> so. There is a video, of course. Oh. So uh, check out the video. Link will be in the show notes. Hotscast.com. And Nevik says that Lily wants your soul. And I believe it, it Creepy does. Face, creepy face yes. does want your soul. Yes, yes. I agree. A little bit. A little bit. Yes. So. Uh, let's move over to New Heroes. Actually, this, uh, this does work out to be a good place to put this. Uh, Mike, good job. Uh, the Weekly <laughs> Sale, because we don't have a uh, section for that yet. Uh, weekly Sale, as we mentioned before, each week the Heroes team is doing a Weekly Sale on Skins and Heroes. This week we've got Tassadar for a sale for, for the low, low price of three dollars twenty four cents. Very worth awesome it. Tassadar hero is if you so like fun, so yeah, fun. Anything. Yes. <laughs> he can DPS. He yes. Can he can kind support. of healish. Not really. Not really. Shield. He's more of a disc priest. Type <laughs> He's a thing. disc priest. Yes. yes. He's a disc put a shield priest. on yeah. and then I it, taught DPS meters the with boss. my disc priest. <laughs> <laughs> I believe. So is Tassadar. Yes. <laughs> okay. Yes. Yeah, so is Tassadar. <laughs> Yes. Uh, High Templar Zeratul, which that skin, while very cool, is really definitely a nod towards StarCraft fans because really only hardcore StarCraft yeah, fans will yeah. understand the difference between Zeratul and High Templar Zeratul. Sadly, I, mean, cool I don't skin. have Zeratul. So, <laughs> so you can get a $2.50 skin right. that doesn't cost anything. That's not, it doesn't, right. isn't worth anything unless I, he's free. That's pretty yes. much it. But that is very cheap. $2.50, $2.49. Yeah. That's yeah. a very good price. And then Medic Uther, which I still think is one of the coolest skins in the game. It's just, it's so cool. And I love that they have changed the uh, sounds for everybody now. So his voice sounds a little more echoey and, and, Spacey and yes, yeah. Medic Uther looks like he has two uh, very large AA batteries in the back of his. He has two suit. very oh, large AA batteries. Yes, yeah. he does. Yeah. <laughs> yes, it, it, it actually needs some power. Like, that like Toy Story, like he's part of yes. the uh, the, like, yeah, he's like, a, the Lightyear brigade, brigade yeah, or Buzz, whatever. Buzz it is. Lightyear. He's yeah. a Buzz Lightyear. He is a Buzz I wish Lightyear. they could do something with Disney and come oh skins my gosh, for heroes with so Disney good. skins or something. Oh my gosh. That would be good. <laughs> oh, come on. That would be so amazing. It is really cool, though, that not only with the game itself we get the mashup, but then they're mashing up with the skins and the champs. Like, yes. That's really cool. Yes. Uh, Nissan Aider says that Lily wants balls. Can't disagree with that. And uh, Nevik says that it, the problem is her eyes are too wide open. And yes, I can agree with that. They are. And too Nevik, wide. yes, they did say that at some point the tiger will be available separately. Some point. We some don't know day. when. We some don't know when. Someday, someday, my prince will come. Yes. <laughs> Kaylee, you want to give us the free hero rotation of the week? I will. So for the week of Tuesday, January twenty seventh, which starts today. We have oh, yeah. Arthas, Elite Torin Chieftain, Kerrigan, Lily. So if you want to get your creepy fix, I get guess. Get your creepy face on. Um, Uther. And then if you're level 12, you can use Nazebo. And if you're level 15 or higher, you can use Tychus. Yeesh. These will be the heroes you will be seeing all the time in quick match. All the time. <laughs> every, every quick match. Every quick match will include at least one, if not two. Or more of these. If not four. <laughs> Probably not four. four. <laughs> and Probably five four. if you happen to pick one, too. <laughs> Are you um, calling all of the beta invitees poor? <laughs> no, it's just, no, that's just how it they, works. They're new, and happens. they'll either have these or the ones in the free, in the map, not in the free, in the map, in the pack that they bought to get in, the founder's yes. pack. Oh. It's either bundle buys or the free revenge. There you go. Yes, yes, yes. Yep. Exactly. Uh, on, it, on it down, though, I, I'm out of beer. So, oh just, my goodness. Yeah. goodness! That's unfortunate. I've consumed all four of the beers I had on my desk. So, uh, damn. <laughs> you may have to go out in the snow uphill both ways. I may have to go up in the snow both <laughs> ways. So buy more beer. Downhill. Yes. Downhill. Yes. <laughs> to school. Uh, hey, says I went uphill so- in a blizzard both ways to get pizza in Pittsburgh. So. It really was uphill both ways. In a, of course in a it is. Farm. It's Pittsburgh. But what is yeah, it? Yeah, it, was as many as San Francisco. it was awesome pizza. It is the best pizza ever anywhere. 
Yeah. I need to well, go to yes. Pittsburgh. I have friends in Pittsburgh, and they keep telling me, you need to come out here because we have awesome food and awesome beer. They do. And I say, there yes, I need awesome to go food. out there. I don't know about awesome beer, but they do have awesome food. They have a ridiculously amazing craft beer scene in, in Pittsburgh right now. Like, insane Pittsburgh. craft beer scene. Can I Pittsburgh. just say my sister just texted me a picture of her watching our podcast on their TV. That's yeah, awesome. They said they were watching I, it on the TV. I saw it. They said, you're on TV. Look. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But the best part about it is her face. It's like. <laughs> yeah. Did she do a selfie with it? Yeah. She yeah. Awesome. self-casted I wish, I wish I could show you, but it will totally wonk out the It will the wonk camera. the camera. You'll turn, you'll turn orange. Oh, wait, yeah, it'll be orange. bad. So I won't do it. But. <laughs> You'll we be may like post a, it on the website. Yes, because it's great. That is great. Send me that. I will post that. Yeah. Um, Nevik points out that there has been a lot of Tychus in the ranked matches. I've noticed that as well. Tychus is. But that a means that people are buying him. Pick. So yes, yes. yes. But yeah. Tychus is a very strong pick in in ranked. Um, yeah, very strong pick, definitely. Uh, let's see. What is next? Uh, let's move on to the community. Oh, no, 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 no. You know what? Let's do... I highlighted it. <laughs> yes. Before we go to the community spotlight, let's do epic fails. <laughs> it's almost like epic wins and epic fails, like, all together wrapped up in one. This actually kind of is an epic win and an epic fail at the same time, except it was an epic win more for you and yes, an epic fail and for not- me. It just you. happened to be the same match. <laughs> yes, yes, fire. it was. Yes, my cat, wait, wait, wait. Yes, my cat caught on fire. <laughs> exactly. It. Okay, so we were playing a game. It was a quick match, I think. Yeah, quick match game. Yeah, it was a quick match. And yeah. um, so, and Rill was playing Stitches. I don't remember who I was playing, but it doesn't really matter in this story. So we're playing, and then all of a sudden, Rill goes on. We were talking on the on thing, and he says, "Oh." That was my daughter. I have. To, I'll be back in a second. Or no, he didn't even say that. He just said that was my daughter, and then there was silence. Well, I from figured him. you could hear. And it was it was late. no, I didn't like hear anything. Yeah, night. yeah, it was oh, late. I figured you could hear. Her. No, I didn't hear you anything. Walked. You said that was my daughter, and then there was nothing from you, and I didn't know Jeez. what was going on. So <laughs> I'm like, okay, cool. That was your daughter. I figured your wife would get you know deal with it or whatever because you're playing a game, right? So maybe you muted yourself to talk to your wife. So I didn't hear you. So I'm like, hello, real? Uh, okay, whatever. And then so we're playing, and then I run across. I'm like, why is real sitting up there? In like sitting and doing nothing, so I'm running over to where he is. I'm like, "Real, where are you? <laughs> hey, real, you're like, hey, what's going on? Are you okay, real? Hello." So <laughs> it's just he's sitting there in the bush. I am watching. I was I died, and so I'm watching him to see if someone from the other team comes over and kills him or does anything to him. And no, he's sitting in the bushes in a perfect place that nobody walks through ever, and he's. People are going around and whatever. Then all of a sudden, one of the guys comes through the bush, runs past him, goes, what? wait, double takes, runs back into the bush, smacks him once, pushing him outside of the bush, then runs away. I, I don't know why. Oh, yo, okay. I know why, because Stitches actually took a swipe at him. I, I don't, that you know, was I, me. you weren't there. That, it, no, that was, was me. No, that was earlier. It was earlier. That was before. Was it? it was way uh, earlier uh, before you came back. So, and I'm like, is it, it hello? So I said, Rill, are you there? And you didn't respond again. So I'm like, that's cool. It's like, it scared him away because <laughs> it just attacked him again. I'm like, oh, great. Okay, this is wonderful. So, and then all of a sudden, we're in the, oh, it was, it was mines. It was mines. All of a sudden, we're like trying to kill the, the golem. I think it was mines. No, we're trying no, to kill no, golem. Was, uh... No? Was it dragon? No, I think it was no, Curse Hollow. Was... It was Curse Hollow. Oh, Hollow. yeah, Curse Hollow. Curse so Hollow. So we're all going See, for the thing. I was in the bushes at their uh their bruise no their um their giant camp i was in yes the, it was yes, in the yes. bushes were, like, right at their giant camp it. like right at their gate like that yeah, little patch yeah, of bushes yeah. right it there. was like yeah but their gate was all dead so right. so therefore so so we're we're like trying to do something i don't know probably going for the thing and one of the guy goes stitches where are you or like you know what's going on and he, you're still alive over there no one's killed you yet it's like right. most of the time you were gone you were alive so, so I'm like, I'm like, oh crap, you know, I'm not going to tell him that he had to run to like do something with his daughter or whatever. I'm like, or, or even like say that I know you. <laughs> so I'm like, um, I think his cat caught on fire. <laughs> Cause I figured if I made them laugh that they wouldn't care that he was AFK. 
Right. Luckily, we were we were kind of staying even with the other team, so it wasn't like we were getting killed, even though it was 5v4 at that point. So they laughed. <laughs> they LOL'd. And um, so Rill actually did finally come back near the end of the game. And uh, about, what, about like 10 minutes out, because that was like how long it told you you were behind and you ended, right? <laughs> so well, you were about no, 10 minutes. I don't know what it was. No, because I came No, it back. could have been 10 minutes. Yeah. It wasn't 10 minutes. I Basically, it was like 11.30 at night. My daughter was sick. And um, uh, no, uh, well, according to Nevik, I was uh, cleaning up spilled beer. Uh, no, yes. I was not cleaning up spilled beer. <laughs> I make more of an announcement when... No, he usually, would just said, I spilled my beer. Oh, I'll clean it up later. <laughs> or, it, or it involves expletives. Um, yes. <laughs> no, she, uh, she was sick. She wasn't feeling good. And she and came. And she lit your cat on fire. She lit the cat on fire. She, the she came fire. into the office and was all like delirious. And I thought Mike heard her say, because I didn't even like mm-hmm. really realize she was. Because I have these giant freaking headphones that are noise canceling, so I could barely hear her until she's standing right next to me. And I look I'm like, ah, and she's like, "Daddy, I don't feel good." So I was like, "Oh, it's my daughter." And then I took I her anything. and you know put her back in bed. And I don't think it was that long. I mean, it was maybe. It was two, a while. It was a was long it? time. It yeah, you were gone for like long. 10 minutes. It was really long. Was it really? I don't think it was yeah. that long. Yeah, it was a long time because I was – I, I had to die. We had a – we had like the curse a couple times. I mean was it, really, it was a it long didn't time. It seem that long. It was really long. I was like, where are you? Rel, well, I where came, are you? I, I kept yelling, Rel. I, <laughs> I see myself sitting in the bush. So I, I click to start moving. I click on the map to start moving. And, as and you I'm said, running, sorry, I, guys. I, Sorry, yeah. guys. And then as soon as I hit, I see it pop up on the screen, so I know I hit it. It did. It and did. then it says, you have gone AFK. And I'm like, oh, so it kicks me out to the load screen. Well, then it says, I'm 16 minutes yeah, so I'm like ahead, behind. behind the server. The I'm the like, server. what? What? Yeah. So then I'm just watching it <laughs> count down. I'm like, you've got to be kidding me. 16 so minutes. I'm like, so th- 16, so the, the great thing was, though, when that happened, we actually got our stitches back. <laughs> so the AI stitches was playing pretty well for us and helped us Probably to win the yeah. game. So we actually we were not doing well near the end, and we actually came back and won the game. Uh, probably in many much part to uh, AI stitches, but <laughs> so we actually came back and won the game, and we win. And Rill's like, oh, it says like a minute and a half still, like in like victory, you know, it says right. a minute, and, a half. minute and, and then half. finally it shows victory behind the thing that he's watching. So he's like, okay, yes, I think it's finally doing it. I know. So I'm yeah. out. I'm like, oh, okay. Woo. We won. I got XP. Yeah. And then yeah, it popped for then you. Nothing. And, and yeah. then it went to show or to match end and I got no XP. I got no rewards. I got nothing. Not a zip zilch. It's as if as if I was never in the match. So moral of the story is you don't have kids so that you don't have to worry about them when you're playing video games. <laughs> yes, but your cat course. could have caught on fire, nerdy. So that <laughs> no, okay. But see, <laughs> you would have just let it I burn. Like, I'm locked in the bedroom when I'm doing stuff. Well, then then if it burns up, then it'll burn. Just burn your bedroom up, and you'll be okay. I would back. be really amazed if my cat could catch itself on fire in my bedroom. You could, no you could spontaneously way. combust. Spontaneous you never know. Combustion. Absolutely. Like, yes. Cats, cats do spontaneously Spontaneous combust. Feline combustion. Yes. I'm going to Google it that is because common. I'm intrigued. Look it up. That could be a show title. Spontaneous feline <laughs> combustion and navel lint are both SFC. scientific things. <laughs> I don't SFC. know where the navel lint just fixed uh, it in that, S- but I just – yes. And yes. that picture is awesome, by the way. Uh, niece and Nader. That's <laughs> I love the look in your face. That's great. Uh oh, your niece. Your niece is on. Your niece is watching us. No, We're talking about niece and Nader. No, <laughs> no, no. Actual like. Oh, okay, actual Aunt niece. Kaylee's oh. on TV. Oh, <laughs> my seven-year-old niece is awake at eleven o'clock at night. That's good. Wow. Well, Listening to us talk about cats on fire. Hello, Mary Ellen. <laughs> Don't hi, your hi, cat. Mary Ellen. Do not light your cat on fire. It's a bad idea. Yeah, and don't, don't worry, your cat will not spontaneously catch on fire. Okay. Yes, no. it will. No, it won't. She yes, it will. No, it won't. That's all gray, <laughs> and she named it. I love gray cats. She named it Gracious. How cute is that? that Isn't that wow. cute? Wow. So, oh, that's, that's so very cute. punny. Send that's a picture. A I want to see a picture. Pun. Seriously. I don't have a picture. All cats. I do not have a picture. Okay, take take a selfie of the cat and the niece in front of the TV with us on. Wait. Yes. 
Hello. And go to bed. You're seven. What's wrong with you? Yeah, go to bed. Hi, Mariella. Hi, baby. <laughs> so that's our cat on fire story. It really was yeah. less cat on fire than anything else. But it was just funny because I figured to have the – if I said, oh, his kid had a problem, they're probably like, oh, great. Really, it sucks. Yeah. But because and I said – I think his cat caught on fire, they laughed, and so it was fine. <laughs> and Sean didn't feel well, so she never even woke up, which is amazing because she's such a light sleeper. I cannot believe she didn't wake up. Usually she'll wake up. She'll intercept Abby on the way to the office and, and take her back to sleep. Um but yeah, I don't know. She didn't wait. She didn't wake up, but she's not feeling well. Um, actually, I no, never mind. I probably shouldn't use this venue to make that <laughs> announcement. But um, we could maybe yeah. talk about something yeah. after 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 the show's over. We have seven year olds uh, watching. <laughs> uh, no, no, it's not that. Um, uh, but yes, um, Nevik. No, this is not. Um, this is not like Coors Light or typical piss water, as you said. This is Lion's Head right there. Lion's Head Pils- Deluxe Pilsner. You know Lion's what? That's the official Pils- beer of the Orlando City. No, not really. It's just, no, I was going to say. Not it's, the city, it's, the, 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 the soccer team. That's what I meant. No, it's not. <laughs> it, 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 <laughs> but it's more the official <laughs> beer of Dunder Mifflin Paper Company. Because Dunder Mifflin Dunder Paper Mifflin. Company. Oh, it's made in Wilkes-Barre, so, which is right next Wilkes-Barre. to Scranton. Wilkes-Barre. Woo. Yes. I've been through there many times. Have you? Me too, actually. Yeah, because I went to school in Pittsburgh and drove to P- Boston a couple of few times. So, so you went right, right through. Right through. Wilkes- you go, you go through Wilkes Bar. Yes, you yes, did. did. Good night, Mariella. Apparently she's going to bed. <laughs> Good night. Good night. <laughs> All right, let's head over to the community spotlight. Uh, first up, wanted to talk about a, uh, a build that was submitted to Heroes Fire by listener of the show and very cool guy Rick who I had the pleasure of meeting at BlizzCon. I am almost certain I met him uh, with Gemmit, Gemmit the Hunter, who uh, is awesome. Uh, I'm pretty sure I met, I think he was with Gemmit. Now I could be remembering that wrong, but I, we did have a nice conversation about heroes at BlizzCon and I'm fairly certain Gemmit was there at the same time. I could be just be remembering that improperly. But anyway, Rick put together a hammer build and submitted it to Heroes Fire. It's a Sergeant very cool build. Hammer. I see. What's that? Sergeant Hammer. Sarge- well, no, it's MC Hammer, actually. It's an oh. MC Hammer build. Awesome. Yes. Does yes. he, like, please, shuffle please backward hammer. and forward and all the time? Please, Hammer, don't hurt him. It's Hammer yeah. time. Oh, oh, yes. Um. <laughs> that should be a skin for Sergeant Hammer, the MC Hammer skin. Oh, with that the big pants! Awesome. Oh my gosh, that would be awesome. He'd in. just be in there in the pants. He would just, like shuffle around There's and ridiculous. like throw things. There's ridiculous <laughs> pants. She should jump out of the tank and start doing the hammer dance in the hammer yes. pants. Okay, so awesome. that should have been in the cat's big section. That should be in the cat's yes, big section. Wrong. Yes, sorry. Let's yes. move that down to the cat's big section. But yeah, this is a it's a very good hammer build. He, dude, he is hardcore hammer. Like, he's the only person I've ever played with that has hammer's master skin. Like, this guy loves Hammer. So uh, check out his build on Heroes Fire. It'll be in the guide. Uh, in the guide. It is a guide. It'll be in the show notes. And uh, give it a thumbs up because that lets more people on Heroes Fire see it. So that would be awesome. Mike, you've got one for us? I do. Uh, so I had been messing around a lot with that Hero GG site from, we talked about last week. Uh, along with Adam. Adam and I were messing with it a lot. But uh, I also found another one. I was just perusing like heroes of the storm replays right and i found one called hot slogs that's why we came up with the name hot slogs hot slogs <laughs> hot, hot slogs hot slogs that's hot logs yes so um h-o-t-s-l-o-g-s dot com this is a dot com not a gg uh go there it has the same kind of functionality as heroes gg um you can you have to register you um tie your account to your account there to your uh, Battle.net account and then you can actually, the cool thing is you can upload your replays, so this is a little different so you, you do upload your replays just like the other one, right um, when you look at your stats, you can actually in your match history, you can actually it gets separated into Hero League and Quick Match, which is nice 
So you can actually see it's a very much more simple display, more like a spreadsheet, like a big list. But then you can break, you can click on it, and it'll open up and show you more information about what happened, who all the people were, what hero they had, what level their heroes were at, what their MMR was, what their MMR change was, based you know all of the information, and you can view their match history based on that too. That nice. person. So it all drills down all over the place, which is cool. And then another cool thing is you can actually say you want to share that replay. So people could download that replay if they wanted oh, to nice. and watch it. But it that's doesn't nice put feature. them out like just when you put them up. They won't automatically do that. Now, of course, if Adam and I were playing and Adam put his replay up and shared it, I don't have a say in whether or not he wanted to share it. But... Um, I like that feature so you can actually watch uh, watch those matches or share them out to, so other people can pick them up and uh, watch the match. So it's kind right. of nifty. And I definitely like that being able to show just Hero League or a quick match in the that match history. That is nice, yes. Because nice. And it has the same type of stats for everything else. It shows you like your hero stats, your map stats. It has MMR milestones, so it'll show you like you know it re it calculates what it thinks your MMR is, and it will like do it over time. It'll show you a graph. Uh, it'll tell you who your friends are, which I think is how based on how many games you play together. Like Rill and I, it shows 48 games played together. Adam and I, 46 games. Um, uh, Kaylee, eight games. Um, you what? know, so. Well, yeah. Of course, obviously, remember, it doesn't include co ops and stuff yeah. like that. And, yeah. you know, and so it's just the, the quick to the service. And, yes. And it won't include anything prior to uh, the last alpha wipe. Okay. So, mm. last wipe. That, that's why. Well, and your GG doesn't either. Which well, I didn't it makes sense until I tried to upload was, everything. That's when they moved over. They, they, they switched the. Um, the uh, the build basically. I mean, that's when it became yeah, a full a on one. build of its own. Yeah, it wasn't just that kind of pieced together StarCraft build. So yeah. that's really when on the technical side, because that was, I mean, that that was when they went live on the live servers too. It wasn't that in was the when server. they went live on the live server. Exact right. <laughs> exact. Yes. So yeah. Exactly. Exactly. Yep. All right. That wraps up the community spotlight section. Uh, Before. Before we wrap up the show, we did want to do, or at least I wanted to. I forgot to put it in the notes, but that's okay. I can throw it on these guys. They're professionals. They know how to handle it. I uh, wanted to talk a little bit about uh, heroes for the beginners, for all you folks that are just coming into the beta. Something that I have noticed, and I'm curious if you guys have as well, uh, that seems to be tough for people coming in is uh, minimap awareness. I don't know if you guys have noticed that, but it seems like people don't know what the minimap is capable of showing them, doing for them. They don't know how to interpret the pings. Uh, are you guys seeing the same thing? Every yeah. MMO, or every MMO, every MOBA that you play <laughs> will have the same issue for right. the, the lower tier of players. Right. It's it's something that comes with experience in the game. Um, why I always tell people that it took me a year to be comfortable with League of Legends is because things like that, like map awareness. Yeah, yep. yeah, I mean, that's just something that comes with practice for it to be natural. And still to this day, there are times where I get zoned and don't look at my map. Right. It's It, it happens, and it, it's just something that you have to kind of, like, get used to doing and really, like, ingrain in yourself, like, I have to pay attention to this mini map. Yeah, one tip even for that is, um, you know, say you know you should be moving to a particular spot. So say you, you use your hearthstone, you hit your B, you use your hearthstone to hearth back to the, I was about to say a temple, to the altar to heal up. And you know you are going back to, say you're playing Dragonshire and you're heading back to the top lane to help out whoever it is that's up there with you. You, you can right click on the mini map to target there and auto run there. While you're running, pay attention to the minimap. Watch what's going on. Watch the movement of the players. There are certain areas that you can't see. That's what's referred to as fog of war. Um, a lot of maps will have watchtowers that will give you viewability of those fog of war areas. Some maps don't, like Dragonshire has no watchtower. But watch the minimap. 
see what's going on, see what things are moving. When you hear that ping sound, that anytime you hear a ping sound, the first thing you should do is look at your mini map. Immediately look at your mini map because it's showing you where that ping is taking place. If it's taking place near you, you actually see it on your screen. That's one of the cool things is that it drops a ping, it drops a, a target, it drops a, a shape, a, a, a reticule on your screen. But if you hear it and don't see it right immediately on your screen, I feel left out that I'm not throwing up the Diablo rock fist on the camera. Uh, if you don't see it, look at your mini map because it'll show you what's going on. And that might clue you into heroes that need help. That might let you know that, you know, there's some three and they need help or yep. any number and of things. And it will also in the chat area it will tell you yes. what it is they actually did or said or what you know what they were trying to say so if like they're going somewhere it says blah oh blah is God. on their way yes. or you know or i blah blah needs help you know like if you alt what is it alt if you alt click on yourself it'll say you need help or something or i don't remember i always just do it i don't really notice what i'm doing but uh i don't even can, know you can do you, that all click yeah, on you, yourself i think whatever it is i think you can click on your do something where you click on yourself and it'll say you need help Oh, I don't know. I just I always use say, the G ping and drop pull down yeah. for assist me. I didn't know. Yeah, there was you can do it. I think you can do like yourself. alt click, and if you alt click on somebody else, it'll say you want to help that. them. It says. Oh, you I always do. Them. I just do the same thing. I do the. Yeah, the, I think the I think G there's a there's an alt, alt click or something like that. I just do it. Yeah, I don't even I realize what I'm doing. So interesting. But uh, yes, so it'll tell you. Interesting. And what world is described would be, of course like reactive so if you see the pings but you can also be proactive with watching your mini map right uh because if you're if you're watching the movement of everybody if you're seeing objectives that can be taken like the mini map does show you uh camp response and obviously with these maps you know getting those camps is a huge part of winning the map yes. so you know if, if you're proactive with map awareness you're going to do a heck of a lot better than if you're reactive. I mean, sometimes you have to be reactive, yep. but just keep that in mind when you're trying to kind of like build up your skills with map awareness. Right. Yeah. The um, one thing also is if you are on chat uh, audio, if you're voice chat with people, with your team, or at least part of your team, it does help if, if you are watching the map, if you're dead, especially you can actually help your team quite a bit while you're dead. And what, oh, it, what you do is you sit there and watch the map. You see, um, all of a sudden, Nova pops up on the map. Oh, Nova's in the bot. Tell everybody. Because right. no, you don't know where Nova is most of the time. When she pops up, tell them where it is. If you all of a sudden see Vala running through the jungle because somehow she came into view from somebody moving up to the mid to gank somebody, hey, Vala's coming up mid. You know, tell everybody. People will appreciate it. And if they don't care, that's fine. But mm -hmm. at least you did what you could do. And that's useful to do even when you're not dead, obviously, if you see it. Like if you're in lane, you see somebody leave your area, you see where they're going. Hey, this guy's moving up to the top or this guy's moving to mid or he's coming your way. Let people know uh, if you can. Right. Now, obviously, if you're not good at typing while you're playing, I wouldn't stop to type. Hey, Vala's moving mid or we got three top, whatever better to play and not to type but if you can yes. type and you can't you know then that it always helps like especially at the beginning of the match say you go in and everybody gets their lane assignments and everything and then you go oh look i'm by myself and there's three top just type three top and then right. if other people see it then at least that they can make a decision as to whether they want to rotate to help cover or just let you sweat it out and enjoy the having nobody in their lane Yes. You know. <laughs> and next week we'll actually we'll go into detail on because um, this is this will literally take up a whole segment of itself the the ability to use what we call the G pink system which is you actually hit the G key and it gives you a target reticule and then you've got four choices where you use them and how you use them gives you so much communication possibility from just that one key that but like I said we'll use that for we'll we'll do that next week because that will literally take up a whole segment on its own. Um, the one last thing I did want to say is you can navigate, and, and when I say navigate, I'm, I'm talking about more uh, of a camera view without just dragging your mouse to the corners of the screen, to the edges of the screen. You can click on the mini-map, left-click on the mini-map, and that will change your view. That'll change the view of your screen 
based on where you're clicking on the mini map. So remember that you can Haunted Mons is a great example. You can be in lane and you know doing your thing, Capit and Merc Camp, and you can click on the mini map for down below and see what's going on down there, even while you're still in your lane. Um, so play with that. Play with the view. Play with the fact that you can change your view with the left click on the mini map versus just moving your mouse from the side to side or up and down. And you know, because that's if you've never played a MOBA before, that's something you might not know that you can do that. And your mini map actually shows a little rectangle for where your view is. You know, that rectangle moves wherever your what your monitor is seeing will show up as a rectangle on your mini map, and you can move that rectangle around. And that's something that pulls directly from StarCraft. If you've played StarCraft two, that will be very comfortable, very familiar to you. Yep. Um, so that's and again, you know, not that I spend a lot of time dead, but maybe I do. But when you're dead is actually a great time <laughs> to help yeah. your team and to look around Absolutely. the map, look at where everybody is, Absolutely. think about what you're going to do when you do come up. So look and say, okay, look, this is what's going on. This is what's going on. Where are people? What's going on here? Type. You can type while you're dead because you're not doing anything else. So good right. time to start typing things like, hey, we need to go. When I get up, why don't we go capture the, the this camp? Or we should go to the bottom thing and just gank them all there or, you know, whatever. But right. You know, start coming up with ideas because just because you're you know. dead doesn't mean you have to run to the fridge for another beer. Exactly, but you just might. well, and you can also use that time when you're dead to trash talk your team, blame them. Oh my gosh, you for you're dying. Blame yes. them for you, you dying. Are so exactly. evil. Because you don't have all chat until the you're end of evil. the game, you can't you're trash evil. talk the other you're team. Evil. So you you're might evil. as well you're trash evil. talk your own team. Yes. Evil. Uh, had uh, to throw it in there. You yes, could you use that time to tell your teammates that the one guy who's AFK is cat caught on fire. The cat caught on fire. <laughs> yes. Yeah. You could do that. Yes. His that's a um I don't I don't even know who that singer is. This world is on fire. I don't even crap, what's that song? Kings of Leon. This world is on yeah. fire. Um, sex, no, that's, uh, sex, um, sex on fire. Sex is on fire, yeah. <laughs> oh, that's what I thought you were talking about. I hate completely pop different music. Thing. I, Eight pop music. music. You would consider pop Kings of Leon pop? pop? That's not pop, Kings of pop, Leon. Pop it's a girl. It's a female singer. Oh, okay. So no, Sex is on Fire is, is um, Kings of Leon. The girl with the piano. Alicia Keys? Thank you. Yep, pop music yes. sucks. Anyway. She's not pop. She is so pop, it's not even funny. Are She's you like kidding? R&B. She, she might be popular, There's no lure, difference between not. pop and R&B. There's no difference. What? R&B is a subcategory of pop. Okay. Different, different... Okay. Different conversation. <laughs> <laughs> yes. All right. Let's wrap this up. <laughs> you can follow the show on Twitter at Hotscast. I am at Rillandoon. That is R I L A N D U N E. Kaylee is at Nerdychar. N E R D I C H A R. And Mike is at Fimless. F I M L Y S. Head to the show's homepage at Hotscast.com. For links to our Facebook, Google+, YouTube pages, show notes, videos, and more. You can email the show at hotscast at gmail.com. For all the services you can think of that relate to a podcast, we can be found as Hotscast. And if you find one that we are not listed as Hotscast, let us know. We are, of course, a Catalyst Gaming Media show. So head over to catalystgamingmedia.com for more awesome shows like... The Nexus Podcast, Frozen Nerds, The Sundering, and all manner of different things. Uh, <laughs> there's show notes. There's, ty- there's things typing into the show notes. <laughs> it's real Added time updates. <laughs> real time yes. updates. Dip, 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 as well dip, dip, as TwistedNether.net, <laughs> which is also part of Twist, uh, the Catalyst Gaming Media Network. Make sure to check that out. That is Mike's other show that he does with Hydra, who is also evil. Actually, she's almost evil. Uh, also, check out. There's still more type. There's typey, typey, typey things. Her cat's not on fire. Yes. At least uh, someone mute. <laughs> yes, that's true. Uh, you can hear Kaylee and Adam, a.k.a. Type. Geek of Random, who's in the show notes right now, <laughs> correcting me that it's Alicia Keys, uh, on Chard Hearts, the internet nerd dating love show. Chard Hearts, which is one of the coolest names ever, at Chard Hearts on the Twitter Find this show, Twist Another Heroically Random, which is my other show that I do with Nevik. We talked to earlier in the, sh- in the chat. And Chart Hearts on iTunes, Stitcher, and any podcatcher app of your choosing. 
help out the show, leave us a review on Stitcher and iTunes, and let us know. Let us know if you let it, if you uh, left us a review, and we'll read it out on the show. We appreciate I it. Probably I haven't checked either. Um, I don't have <laughs> iTunes on this computer, nor will I ever. But I will check if you let us know that you left us a, uh, uh, a review. So uh, send us your emails, and uh, send us your, if, if you have a build on Heroes Fire like Rick did. Let us know. We'll post it. We'll uh, get you some some views on it. And until next time, folks, never stop asking yourself that question. Who is your hero? Cheers. Bye. Bye, Bye guys. Hopefully your niece is in bed. Yeah, I think, I think she is. <laughs> okay, good.